Okay, so here we go again. It's Friday, it's happy hour, your stomach's empty, your wallet's light, your spirits are kind of low. Let's do something about all three. And here, of course, is how you play this game. At some places, you order a drink and you get to eat for free. At some bars and restaurants during happy hour or hours, the house will fork over free food. You just have to know which places to visit. And they say you should never drink alone, which is why I have a guest today, Annalie Rufus. How are you, Annalie? Hi. Annalie is with the East Bay Express, and she's an expert on happy hours and... Scavenging. Free food. Annalie co-authored The Scavenger's Manifesto. Which is a guide to legal ways of acquiring things for less than full price. Best of all, for free. Annalie is also a contributing correspondent for the East Bay Express and regularly reports on happy hour haunts offering free eats. Including this venerable East Bay restaurant, King's Inn, 1699 Solano Avenue in Berkeley, which just opened a new bar. It's a classic old Berkeley family restaurant that now has a great happy hour and a great bar. First, order a drink from the bar, and we recommend bar manager Mike Diebel's signature drink, the Skittle Vodka. Mike painstakingly sorts out Skittles by flavor and then infuses vodka with the tangy candy. It's Skittlicious. Now, investing in a beverage at King's Inn's entitles you to indulge in a spread including zesty meatballs, fried wonton noodles, and spring rolls. All you can eat. Who's the smarter person? The person who pays 40 bucks for drinks and a meal or the person who pays five bucks for drinks and a meal? Let's go find another place. Let's. Let's go. Next stop, Il Pescatore, Jack London Square. And Il Pescatore gets points for atmosphere, whining and dining next to the water, and during happy hour, the chef serves up quite a feast. What a spread. I think this is the best one we've seen so far. Look at this, like a four-course meal here. Cold cuts, bruschetta, sandwiches, steamed vegetables and chicken, and meatballs, not to mention cheese and olives, of course. Not just olives, but Kalamata olives. You know, these are, what, $6 a pound? This is all free, folks. And free is the best price of all. Should I feel guilty about doing this? No, God, why? Why do you even think that? No, 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 because look, they're putting it here. You're not stealing. Rule number one in the Scavenger's Manifesto scavenging commandments is don't steal. Only feel obligated to order a drink, like, say, Il Pescatore's signature, Negroni. And for our last stop, how about a nice Cuban? No, not a cigar. La Taza de Cafe, 3909 Grand Avenue, Oakland. La Taza offers Cuban and Latin American fare, and to that end, Come Happy Hour serves up a $5 wine and tapas combo. But remember, we're in search of free eats, and as it turns out, at Happy Hour, La Taza does offer free appetizers. So they call these banderillas. Banderillas slices of ham and gourmet cheese and the chef likes to surprise happy hour guests with a free sampling of food from the regular menu tonight it was baby squid sauteed in its own ink and while you're at it enjoy the bar's selection of spanish wine or you might want to order their signature drink el diablo for all the places we visited, log on to cbs5.com slash Isla Bay. And you may want to pick up Annalise's book on how to eat for cheap or for free. More places should have happy hours. That's why they call it happy hours. That's yes, we're happy, right?